Hi, I'm Louise Borden, and I'm the author of America Is, a book I'm going to share with you today during the Barnes & Noble story time. And today is a big day. It's the 4th of July, 2020, the birthday for the United States of America. It's our 244th birthday. Imagine how old our country is. Years ago, I was speaking to students in Birmingham, England, and their first question to me was, what's it like in America? They were so curious about our country. So I went home to my desk in Ohio and tried to find just the right words to tell those students about our country. America is the stories of all of us told together, and I hope that you can find yourself on one of the pages of this book. I wrote the words in Cincinnati, Ohio. The beautiful pictures were made by Stacy Shewitt, who lives in California, and America Is was published in New York City by Simon & Schuster. So I like to think of it as a coast-to-coast -coast book. Happy birthday, America. Here we go. America is our country. It is the place we call home. We are the nation whose name means freedom to people all over the world. America is 50 states from the Atlantic coast to the Pacific Ocean and beyond, the United States of America. Some states are big, some states are small. 13 of the states are very old. The rest came later, one by one. America is a flag of stars and stripes, 50 stars for the 50 states we have now, 13 stripes for the 13 states that began our nation. America is the pledge we say at school. It is the song we sing, hands over our hearts. America is old barns and country roads, fields of corn and wheat, and farmers who work sun up to sundown. American farmers grow food that feeds families all over the world. America is teachers and their students in schools in every state, and miners and factory workers, artists and musicians, bakers and bankers, and millions of other people who work at many different kinds of jobs at every hour of the day and night. America is skyscrapers, tall with many windows, up, up, up. And people in cities who rush to and from work, in cars, in buses, in taxi cabs, on subways and fast trains, whoosh, honk, honk, hurry, hurry, from New York City to Chicago to Los Angeles, this is America. America is the swamps and bayous of the Deep South and ponds that glimmer from east to west and lakes so huge and deep they seem as big as an ocean and rushing streams and creeks and brooks and rivers that are long and wide that bring our states together as one vast land from the Hudson to the Ohio, to the Mississippi, to the Columbia. This is America. America is home to its very first people, the proud tribes who live in peace with the earth and the sky, whose words bring wisdom to all who listen. And America is those of us who came later, many kinds of people from many countries of the world, we are one family and one team. We are Americans. And America is the prairie, tall grass and wind and stars. Listen, this is America. America is the stone walls of New England, the forest of the Northwest, the osprey and oysters of the Chesapeake Bay, and Minnesota winters 10 degrees below zero and sometimes colder. The West and its ranches are a part of this nation too, with 10 gallon hats and boots and spurs, with herds of cattle and lassos and cowboys' hands. Rodeo, yippee yay yay this is America. America is rugged mountains with caps of snow and deserts that are hot and dry, 110 degrees in the shade. It is Niagara Falls, the Grand Canyon, and sandy beaches to fly a kite on or dig all the way to China. So much to see in every state, America. 
America is big trucks and wide horizons and roads that take us east and west, north and south. And America is old towns with old names and new towns yet to be that tell our history then and now. It is a nation where 50 states meet, where we are all one. America is the land where we are free to live, to speak out, to worship, to work, to play, to follow our dreams. America is names we remember, like George Washington, Betsy Ross, Ben Franklin, Harriet Tubman, Abraham Lincoln, Eleanor Roosevelt, and Martin Luther King, and holidays we call our own, like Thanksgiving in November, and the 4th of July, that's today, when every summer and every state fireworks light up our sky. Happy birthday, America. America is letters and phone calls, emails and texts from family, from friends, from the 50 states near and far, vacations and reunions. We connect across the rivers, across the mountains, across the miles, across America. And this is your page. America is the stories of all of us told together. From continent to continent across the world, we are the nation whose name means freedom. America is our country. It is the place we call home. Happy birthday, America. <laughs>